so it's a really nasty day out today so I'm back working on my uh, little fork that I'm making here so I have it all welded up uh, all the welds turned out pretty good so I was happy with those um, you know most of them are alright so the last thing I need to do then is make the mounting points for your three point linkage so I had these pieces already I just cut them off uh, it's pretty thick steel they already have big holes in them so that'll do for my top link I'll just weld the two of them on there another one here and I have to drill out the ones for the bottom lower lengths so I have this pretty heavy steel here as well so that'll do fine so I'm going to drill those out um, to inch and a quarter I think is the big bit that I have I only have one big bit uh, and I have to drill those on the lathe so that'll be kind of interesting Okay, so that's my lathe it's a Colchester Bantam 1600 anyone who took metalwork in school in the 80s and early 90s will probably recognize one of these so that's what I'm going to use to drill out these big plates that I want to make the lower links for my little handler that I'm making oh which is a bit shy Random songs. Yeah. I have one of these things, which is a center point drill bit, uh, which should work a little bit better. Um, it'll drill a small little hole in the center, uh, so you can center your bigger drill bit, but it's quite a big piece of metal, so it will, it'll stay steady for me, hopefully. Drill 12 and a half so I can put in the big drill bit now. Let's go. Safety glasses on. Might even still be a little bit fast, but should I give it a go? Nicely. I've got all those uh, linkage mountain points welded on. It all worked out pretty well, especially those ones that I drilled out there. So we should have this finished in no time at all. Okay, so I put a bit of primer on the parts that were just bare metal. I didn't bother priming all of it because some of it's already painted. I uh, did all the bottom piece there because the paint is flaking off. So. Just did it with the wire brush on the angle grinder, ran it around, uh, got all the flaky bits off and all the bits of loose rust off, and just primed it up with normal primer. Uh, it dries it in about a half an hour, so I think we're ready for some John Deere green. Okay, so that's all the green done, so next thing I want to do is just to freshen up those tines, I'm going to paint them Massey Ferguson red. So I just rub them down with the wire brush and the angle grinder first. 
make sure all the loose rust and stuff is off them. So the last job I'm doing on this fork is just to make up a couple of these pins, uh, just the linkage pins uh, for the fork. So they're actually the screw-in towing eyes out of Volkswagens. I just have three. It happen to have three of those, so I just have to turn them down a little bit. And that's the pin made, with a hole in it and the whole lot. Perfect job.